I'll be going over the terms for alternating current and what their uses are and how to calculate them. The first term we'll be discussing is the period. A period is the time for a wave to complete one cycle. Another way to phrase that is that a period is the time that it takes for the pattern of the wave to repeat. Now how you calculate the period for AC, for example, for a standard USA wall socket, uh, it comes out at 60 cycles a second or 60 hertz. Therefore, one period equals one over 60 seconds or one sixtieth of a second. Now to note, a hert is the number of periods or cycles in a second. On to our second term. What is a peak? Peak is the maximum value for the sine wave. There's a positive and a negative peak. Now how you calculate the peak value is you take the RMS value and you divide that by 0.707. You could also just multiply the RMS value times the square root of 2. You can also divide the average value by 0.637 to get the peak value. Now I'd like to note that the peak value for a standard USA wall socket is 170 volts. Not to confuse you guys too much, but I know you guys are thinking, oh wait, the USA wall stock is 120 volts, which that's 120 volts RMS, which will be our next topic. So what is root mean square or RMS value? The RMS value equals the effective value. This is the value of AC voltage or current producing the same heating effect as an equal value of DC voltage or current. To put it into easier to understand terms, put a graph in the right hand corner. If you were to make a graph of the equivalent RMS voltage or current, you would get a line that is right at the RMS value. So to calculate the RMS value, you can take the peak value times 0.707 or you can simply divide the peak value by the square root of 2. If you were to get the average value, you can times that by 1.11 to get the RMS value. Now I'd like to note in the USA, the RMS value is used to measure the voltage in AC. When someone says that a standard wall socket is 120 volts, they are talking in terms of RMS voltage. Now for our final topic, what is the average value? The average value is the area under half a period of the sine wave below or above the x-axis divided by time. You can calculate the average value by taking the RMS value times 0.901 or you can take the peak value times 0.637. Now I'd like to make a note of that the average value is not 50% of the peak value. This is due to the sine wave not being a linear function. Average value will come up when you are doing rectification of AC or changing of AC to DC, and that concludes this video. Thank you for watching. Uh, subscribe if you'd like to see more.